Back in May of 2014, the company known as GameSpy shut down its online servers for hundreds of PC games. One of the games affected by this was sadly Saints Row 2. This meant that many PC gamers could no longer host a co-op or multiplayer session. Fortunately, there are a few methods you can use to play this game online, and since I'm constantly messaged about it, I thought it was time to make a tutorial. Today, I'll be showing you how to play Saints Row 2 online for the PC. Okay, to start off, you'll want to open up your web browser. Now either look up Evolve in the search engine, or go down and click on the link in the description. You should end up on this page. Evolve is the program we'll be using to play with other players on Saints Row 2. You'll now want to click on the download button on the top right of the page. Now select Run Program and press OK to any pop-ups you may get. You should eventually see a license agreement page. Just click the bottom left checkbox and the program should begin installing. Once it's done, you'll have to make an account using your email and a nickname. You should finally have the home page of Evolve open now. This is when you'll either want to create a party or have a person you want to play Saintro with make a party. You can create the party by clicking on Evolve on the top left corner. It may ask you to install some updates, just click OK and the window should open. You can now either invite someone by typing in their nickname or by creating a link and messaging it to them. Once it says the person's in your party, you can minimize Evolve and go on to Saints Row 2. When you're on the home page, go to Co-op, Land Party, then create a name for yourself. Then go to Load Game. If your partner is the host of the Evolve Party, simply have them do the steps and you will instead choose Find a Game. When the game starts, it'll ask you to wait. Here, the co-op partner must press Find Game and click on the host server. And that's it, you should now be running a successful co-op game. The steps to make a multiplayer game is near identical, but if you have Gentleman of the Row mod installed, you'll have to remove it. If you don't remove the mod, you'll run into some serious problems. <laughs> well guys, I hope this tutorial had everything you needed to know to play Saints Row 2 online. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave a comment below. By the way, tomorrow Flippy and I will be running a Saints Row 2 multiplayer stream on the PC. Anyone is welcome to join, but we recommend you join our Saints Row the Score chat so you can get all the details. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Hey.